A real ghost ship. The ship seems to have been built by humans. I wonder what's happened to its crew. There are ghosts, dummy. <laughs> uh, okay. So that was it for the the chaos beast, huh? That's a trap. Well, thank you for warning me about that. I would never have known. Um, uh, we gotta shoot, 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 or do this. I like this though. Oh, this is great. I like this. <laughs> I'm gonna use this move from now on. Yeah, why bother shooting when you could do this? It seems to just decapitate them and then uh, we move on. Uh-oh. Well, that wasn't so great. <laughs> That's the downside. I get it now. Even if the crew survived, they must have all run away from this place. I still can't see why <laughs> someone would need such a huge ship. It doesn't make sense here in Dragonland. Yes, it does. You gotta get all that treasure. <laughs> You're a treasure hunter. You gotta get a big boat to take it all back. We've disabled the barriers. We're we gonna fly away? Yeah, I was gonna say, you know, she says, um... It doesn't even look like it's in that bad of shape. Uh, these holes beg to differ. I understand you could probably, um, you could probably man a hot air balloon with a with a few holes here and there, right? You like you kind of have to have some to let some oh, let anyone go. some air escape and all that. I oh, don't care. <laughs> Okay, so even when they're blocking, I can I can sort of maybe do some chip damage to them or something? Maybe not. <laughs> that seems like the way to do it. Do I gain combo when they're blocking? I totally do. So there's no reason not to just grind this guy into the dirt doing this and get my healing back. That seems like a good plan. Yeah. Don't worry, buddy. You just gotta endure a little bit more. Oh, and he fell down. Okay, there we go. Now, now I can kick your butt. <laughs> Come at me. Uh, let's do it this way. <laughs> nice. We can do a finisher out of the gun. Okay, I like that. Yeah, it's, a, it's just something about that whole RB finisher thing. Just doesn't really work. Okay, okay, this was a perfect example. What's going on here? Let me try to repeat that. No, it worked there. Because I was going to say, is it elevated terrain? Is she getting stuck on something? She's getting stuck, stuck on something. Something right here. That's what's causing it. Yeah, that's what it is. There's just these little anomalies in the terrain that are causing her to get stuck. Oh, no. Yeah. Takes just a few seconds longer to get over whatever this rock is here. <laughs> and that's what was happening over there. Interesting. And it's kind of one of those things that a lot of the times in... Especially older level design, you you just if you saw something like that, it would be grounded to the texture enough that like maybe there was an invisible hitbox that leveled it out a little bit more, you know, so that it wasn't just literally this rock as you see it. So you can see her doing that. You can see her animation is or, or her she's she's kind of got a rig that I guess is like um, the best comparison I can make is to like Shadow of the Colossus was where I saw this kind of tech first. Um, where her legs naturally adapt to angle the position that she's standing on, like that. Um, if she's not standing flat. So it's interesting, but it's causing this thing where she just kind of gets stuck for a second on those those weird edges. Okay, <laughs> that's enough uh, QA work, I guess. Uh, anyway, it's, it's just so strange to see that kind of an issue happen. Oh, and that, um, 
And that target lock thing where it's like shaking the camera, I don't know what's causing that at all. Seems to happen. Let me see if I can get that to happen and see what was what was actually causing it. It's oh it's oh I see what it's happening. So it's trying to get a perfect um, a perfect angle between her and the object. So like if I'm standing here, that's it's a perfect uh, perfect line between the camera position, her position, and the object's position. Right? Like it's just trying to it's trying to draw a straight line. But when she's on the ground, and the object is that high in the air, it can't do that. Like this is this is perfect. If I go under here. No, no, it's working. Uh, it's when I'm moving, though. And that may have to do with the terrain. Hmm. Weird. All these little things that I have to consider. Okay, is this happen? It doesn't happen when it's on an even level. It just happens when it's above me. Yeah, just if I'm down here. Yeah, and I suspect it's the same thing, right? Like, it's... Oh, boy. Like here, it's adjusted no problem. If I do that, because it's snapping, and that's the problem. As I move, it's having to readjust. And something about this is causing it problems. Huh. <laughs> Interesting. Okay. All right. So where are we headed? Now that I've now that I've wasted like ten minutes <laughs> troubleshooting weird problems in the game. It looks like there's a passage here. <laughs> yeah, it's just another one of those things. Like, uh, in the last decade, there was been a lot of talk about like <laughs> put lights to, the, no to show where you're supposed no to go. Treasure, girl. And why do you think I'd care? I might be stupid, but not that stupid. There's only one reason why we're all here, but guess what? There's nothing. Not even a sliver of gold, but I guess if you can't take it back, it's of no use anyway. That can't be. Then why is the guild so rich? Come on, stop playing dumb. Think about what they promised you about Dragonland. We searched everywhere, everywhere, but found nothing. But we do have a plan. We are repairing a ship so we can fly out of this damn island. You can stay with us and help out with the ship. Ship? You're gonna fly? Open your eyes. There are flying corals everywhere. They'll lift our ship into the air and we can get off this island. So you think it's that easy? We're in an entirely different world. Stop acting like you know everything about Dragonland. Besides, you just got here. I highly recommend that you stay with us. Thanks for the invite, but I don't trust strangers. I'm Michelle. And now that we are properly acquainted, you can accompany me to our base. People like you who wander the island cause trouble for us, who have a plan to survive. Ugh, as you wish. Then I'll give you one friendly warning. Just stay off the northern part of the island. This is for the good of both you and me. They really, really think that they're doing a stellar like job that. with the acting, <laughs> and and to the uh, to the um, mocap people's credit, they are. It's just very funny. <laughs> All right, we're off to a start, huh? Okay, it's it's moments like that that keep me going <laughs> through the bad combat. That girl seems really determined on her plan. You think it's possible to leave the island with a ship? Clearly not. The question is why Michelle <laughs> believes in it. And if she doesn't? Exactly. We need to keep that in mind when we meet her friends. Okay, actual plot's happening. We're going somewhere. Nice. You know, okay, so I I was starting to say this earlier and I got sidetracked, but this game is, is not quite a sequel, but it is... Um, it's supposed to be like a spiritual successor to a game called uh, X Blades, which was on the on the PlayStation Three and Xbox. Oh my God, I got killed by that. <clears throat> Hopefully, that doesn't put me too far back. Oh, I have no healing now. Darn. Anyway, 
Uh, and I have X Blades on the PS3. Maybe maybe I can play it at some point. I don't think this was on the PS3. I could be wrong. Oh, I can't lock onto these guys. I have to shoot them. Oops. <laughs> yeah, that's gonna be a problem. Okay. I gotta get better at this. I gotta learn how to actually actually do the shooties. <laughs> if I'm gonna play a game like this for 10 hours or however long this game is. Oh wow. Okay then. <laughs> this is your friend, huh? <laughs> Wandering around, stupid and stubborn, mindlessly coming to surrender their life force to the chaos to make us powerful to fulfill us. Be careful, Ayumi. He's a dangerous enemy. Don't be in a hurry to fight. Discover more about him first. He knows a lot of spells. <laughs> He knows a lot of spells as he hits me with a fireball. Okay. Um. So am I supposed to leave? That made it sound almost like a, you know, oh, why don't you talk to him first? I mean, he seems to speak English just fine. Um. <laughs> but he's got a health bar. That fat, ugly man has to die because he's shooting fireballs. <laughs> okay, what is that? Still never figured out what those were. Okay. Let's get serious. Is that working? Sure doesn't seem to be. Oops. Yeah, it takes like a quarter of my health every time. <laughs> Ew, that's gonna be uh, it's gonna be awkward if I have to deal with that. Yeah, that doesn't seem to be uh, doing any chip damage at all. Okay, let's see here. Get behind him. So you want new souls? Are you sure that you won't burst? Get out of my way. <laughs> was that a was that a fat joke? <laughs> I think it was. Well, this is, um, interesting. This is what we're supposed to be doing, huh? Yeah. And then we just get out of the way when he's gonna do a burst. <laughs> His big, uh, fart gas attack. Oh, wow. Well, this fight ended up being a little more one-note. I do like the creativity to the, to the two boss battles, though, so far. It's like, this is kind of an interesting way of handling all this, even if it's, like, not the most fun. It is very one-note. Well, get out of there. Still got one more hit to... Get off on him. There we go. <laughs> Clear the jungle? Okay, then I guess this was the end of this, uh, this level. Well, okay then. That shaman was a servant of the Chaos Keeper. A soul gatherer. Where did the whole chaos thing come from? One day, it just invaded our world. <laughs> the Keeper of Chaos was so powerful that even the dragons could not resist him. So you're saying that the Keeper now rules everything? To be exact, no. As far as I know, the Vicar of Chaos does. He has taken homage up north. To reach the sphere in the Dragon Temple, we will have to cross the land he reigns over. Okay, so we're going forward. <laughs> Where did the chaos come from? It just appeared one day. It 
Slide attack. Ooh. Gain skull. Uh, press B and right trigger. Okay. B and right trigger. Casting spells doesn't completely deplete... Doesn't fully deplete the rage meter. Oh, I want that one. I don't even know what the other ones are. Okay. Whoops. Oh man, even in the tutorial fight, I'm uh, taking hits here. Okay, so now that I have that, let's try this. What the heck? Okay. Oh, well... Okay, that's right trigger. Oh, I have to hit it at the same time. Okay. Interesting. I don't know if I like that. <laughs> I thought that would be a cool attack considering I have to dash so much, but... That's not particularly helpful. Dashing into attacks is not something I want to be doing very much of. Most of the time I'm trying to dash out of attacks and not into them. Yeah, that's going to get me into problems like that, when I have to do crowd control. <laughs> Not to mention, you could miss really easily it's, uh, with that. It's a lot easier to uh, just pull off one of the other spells instead. Okay, so we're going to put that one on the uh, pile of not going to use again. <laughs> maybe. Maybe someday. <laughs>